So guys, for the first step, you want to head over to search and type in view network connections. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to click on your network adapter. Then you want to click on properties and then click on internet protocol version four. And then you want to make sure that use the following DNS server address has been selected. You want to make the first line 8888 and you want to make the second line 8844 and then click on OK. Now for the second step, you want to head over to search and type in Windows Defender Firewall. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to click on Advanced Settings. And then you want to click on Inbound Rules and then click on New Rule. Then you want to make sure that Port has been selected and then click on Next. And then in this box, you want to type in 49152-65535 and then click on next, click on next again, click on next again. And then for the name, you could just put anything, so rainbow, and then click on finish. Now for the third step, you want to head over to search again and type in network reset, click on it. Then you want to click on reset now and then click on yes. Now for the next step, you want to head over to search and type in CMD, then you want to run it as administrator and then click on yes. Now once you're on this, we're going to type in ipconfig space forward slash flush dns and then click on enter. Then we're going to type in netsh space winsock space reset and click on enter again. Now you want to restart your computer and then the problem should be fixed.